morning we are still in london we're just heading into central london now it's cold today isn't it Stephen? Yeah. really cold we i wanted to go ice skating today Stephen doesn't want to go so i don't think we're gonna go i'm not sure what exactly we're doing we're meeting my sister after work like quarter past five ish up at lloyd so we've got a couple of hours, Stephen's starving, so we're going to go and get some food first off, going to get some lunch. It's not the morning, if I'm honest, it's about one o'clock. So, we need some lunch. I was, it was funny this morning. I was trying to sort out a birthday present for my nephew. And um, I needed to speak to my mum about something, so I phoned her. I was on the phone to her for about 40 minutes, and she was talking about, um, she was like, where are you, what time is it where you are, and everything, and I was like, crap it's like quite past three or something and like i had to like think of things i've just basically lied throughout the whole conversation and she was saying that um she was speaking to someone and because we're in bangkok they think maybe that we were flying home for christmas i was like oh no i wouldn't be coming home for christmas there's no way i can afford to come home for christmas i was like completely just lied the whole way through the conversation oops Like Stephen's hungry, so we're gonna go and grab something to eat. We haven't really got time to do anything, which is a bit of a shame and a bit annoying, but I think we're gonna go here. Weatherspoons for some lunch. Yeah? Oh yes please, a bit of salt on my chips. I've gone for veggie lasagna. Steven's got a burger. We've eaten our lunch, that was nice. We're just gonna have a little wander down. Wander down to the river and just i don't know we're not really doing anything we're just going to kill a bit of time we're going to do a little bit of christmas shopping maybe not really sure oh ice skating we could go ice skating there's ice skating down here by the tower of london we did it maybe was it two years ago we ice skated here stephen i think it was two years ago yeah last year we went here we ice skated in italy I instead you didn't want to take a picture in i really want to ice skate you don't want to, I'm not going by myself. Well, so what Stephen is doing is we're just standing here watching them and he's giving little advice and talking about who's bad and who's good, like we're experts on the top of topic. Think about ice skating. I hate it when there's good ice skaters. You want to watch like crappy ice skaters, don't you? <laughs> oh look, he's wearing a penguin top. I like his hoodie. He's got a cool hoodie. Let me try and show you. Oh, I didn't realise the guy in the penguin hoodie was the guy that's doing that. To the sat like feet out to the side, but that's who I'm talking about. That guy there. He's got a penguin hoodie. Yeah, like legs to the side. I know I can't even do that. <laughs> These hands, by the way, are freezing. Managed to get one little Christmas present for someone. It's a tiny little thing, but I got something. I'm gonna walk along the river now. Stephen doesn't want to. <laughs> he wants to play.
disappointed with this day, to be honest. I haven't done anything Christmassy or anything. I can hear some carols though. Can you hear that? Oh, we're in a manger, you might be able to hear it. I don't know this bit of the song. Real morning. Stephen's just fallen over on these like things, these like step things. What are you gonna do a reenactment? He did a jump. He jumped up and he missed. He missed it. He didn't lift his leg up high, so he just went bang. He's broken his knee, apparently. An elbow. He broke, his, he broke his elbow before. He's broken his knee now and his He's ankle as well. So, I don't know what we're going to do with him. It's difficult for them. We are going to head up to my sister's work now. It's about 10 past 4. It is. And we're going to head up to Lloyd's. I think we're going to stop off at um, the monument, the a pub near the monument and just have a drink because she's not going to finish for a little bit. Here we are at the monument and we're going over to the monument pub just to wait for a little bit. Stephen just said, do you remember when we went up there? It was probably, what Stephen? Like four years ago or something? Maybe like four years ago you can walk up the top. It's something like 344 steps, is it? Something like that, I can't quite remember. Yeah. We were like, yeah, 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 let's walk up there. We got about halfway, the steps are all uneven. And like, is it spiral? It's a spiral. And people go up and down on the same stairs. And we got like halfway and we're like, we can't do this. I think he's telling with us. Stop. She got down first and she got the oyster card thing. Oh, yeah. Tilly with us. Yeah. That's why she got this. Yeah, Tilly was with us. Oh, like my mum's best friend's granddaughter was with us. And we went up and like all of us individually were thinking as we were walking up, we were like, I can't do anything I can do anymore, I don't think I can do anymore. And I think it's Tilly start crying. I think Tilly started crying or something and then Stephen was like, I don't think I can go any further. I was like, oh my god, thank goodness. So I didn't know what I was gonna do because the kids were like going up and I was like, if these kids wanna continue up, I'm gonna have to continue up. But luckily they didn't, so we just came out down. But when we walked out, they still gave us like a little certificate, so we've all got a certificate. It said like I climbed the heard many steps to the monument. I put an arrow going on. Oh yeah, you did. I didn't. I just tell people that I walked up, but like now you all know that I only got halfway. We've got a bit of jet lag going on here. It's like half past four and he's absolutely shattered. Bless him. <laughs> So we've just left. Stephen's just said he almost fell asleep. Do we or do we not have evidence that he was asleep? I think we do have evidence that he actually was asleep. <laughs> We're just gonna walk up to Lloyd's now. By my sister, it's like 10 past five. She should be finishing any time now. I have no idea what building this is, but we like that it has a Christmas tree at the top of it like that. Does anybody know what building this is called? <laughs> It's by Leadenhall Market. I don't know. Yeah. We're just approaching Lloyd now. My sister gets a taxi home from work every night, so hopefully she's there, the taxi's there. We can just get in and get home. Hey, Lara's here. We've been waiting for ages for her. I have to excuse this like super scary lighting, but we are back at my sister's house now. It is super early. My voice is going weird. I don't know what's the matter <clears throat> with me, but it is 20 past eight and Stephen is fast asleep. He's been, he's like just opposite me. I probably should, well, no, I don't think me talking like this is gonna wake him at all. But um, yeah, as soon as he, like, you saw before he was shattered we were having a drink before and we got in and he spent maybe like half an hour on the iPad or whatever and then was just like went straight to sleep he's been asleep maybe for an hour or so it's so like 20 past 7 
jet lag, but not too bad. I'm feeling quite tired as well. I've just been recording a gaming channel video. Uh, Super Mario came out today. So I was super excited for it, but I don't know. I was kind of disappointed, I think. Maybe I need to just explore the game more. But I am going to go to bed soonish. Do a little bit of editing, probably, and go to bed. And tomorrow. I'm not going to tell you what's going to happen tomorrow, but yeah, tomorrow we are doing something, obviously, and <laughs> you'll have to watch to find out what we do. But thank you for watching today, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night.